I loved seeing that a drag king won the uh, your very own drag competition, the drag queen of the year pageant competition awards contest competition. It's a mouthful. <laughs> you know a mouthful. I know a mouthful. That's a mouthful. The con- <laughs> the competition was all inclusive. Um, knowing that, what forms of drag would you like to see elevated, and how would you like to see the art form diversify moving forward? Well, the thing for me, and like the reason we started, do- the reason Lola and I started doing the Drag Queen of the Year pageant is like, drag has always been crazy diverse like crazy like it it has always been you're sharing a dressing room with the drag kings and the afab performers and the male performers and the burlesque performers and everyone has been ever since anyone who has done drag for more than five minutes knows that to be the reality so we found it really strange that like that like there were sort of there wasn't a competition that sort of was open to all these different avenues of drag. And it was always very like compartmentalized. So we were like, what if we just did it and like saw what happened? So we did it as an experiment and, um, and it was really major and the show was incredible. So like, I don't, I mean, drag race is the sort of gold standard of drag competitions in, in the current, like landscape of the world and the good thing that's hopeful is drag race is always changing it up and always evolving with the times so like i i could see i could see a drag king getting thrown into the mix i could see an afab performer uh getting thrown into the mix you know what i mean i think it's possible so who knows Anus thing is possible. <laughs> I need that. I need that shirt. I need that on every article of clothing. I just need to remember that to get me through the pandemic. <laughs> um, I yeah, I think that that's true. I also wonder if it's taken too long to um, get to where Drag Race has gotten. You know, we're on season thirteen. I guess yes, it's great that the first trans contestant is a part of the show. Um, do you think that there are too many rules on the show in general? Well, uh, I think, well, okay. The show is really great. I love, I love the fucking show and a lot of people do. And it's changed culture and it's changed the world. And so like, but you know, they, they do have rules to entry if it were up to me, I would blow the walls off and I would say, like, let's let's have everyone apply and see what that looks like. Do I think that's going to happen? Probably not like anytime soon, but it is hopeful to see that like dra- the people who put on the show Drag Race are very aware of of culture and they are always like actively changing the show and keeping it fresh and keeping it current so like that makes me hopeful 